Hello, my dear kids! At this moment, I'm just about to show you how to draw Gordon, the big engine number four. The biggest train that carries express. Can you imagine that? Have you ever seen him? Alright, let's begin. I'll show you how to do that. My first line would be for Gordon's wagon attached to him. Then, of course, I will proceed and start drawing Gordon's bottom part. Line by line. Nice and slow. And now, two couplers on the very front, looking like two small circles. It's very easy. Here, I'm coming back to Gordon's wagon at the back. So, I will draw its main body. A couple of other lines. And of course, number four at the very center. Do you know why? <laughs> right, because Gordon is the number four engine. Then again, I'm coming back to Gordon himself and drawing a door and a small window. Here you are. Now I'm drawing Gordon's roof. Switching to his main body. Then I'm showing three specifically designated areas right above the driving wheels. Here they are. And here, let's draw contours of Gordon's face. Just an oval. It's pretty simple. After that, we will draw his eyes. Circles again, right? Nose. And smiling face. Oh! Don't forget about the eyebrows just above the eyes. And then I will add just a few lines under the face. Good job! Cool! And now on the very top we will draw Gordon's pipe. After this, I will draw small windows and then add some more minor details on Gordon's body. And here I am switching back to the wagon and drawing a pile of coal in it. Then I'm drawing almost a straight line to show the ground. Okay, here I'm drawing Gordon's three big driving wheels. And 
and then just one tiny small wheel on the left and two more on the right. And here's one more line to show the rails. Awesome! Now, I'm coming back to the wagon and draw its three tiny nice wheels. Here, I will connect three big wheels between each other. Excellent! Looks like Gordon is fully drawn now, and we can start coloring him. Are you excited to do that? Well, I definitely am. Let's do it! The very first color that I will use is yellow. Yellow. It will go for the window, then for the digit 4, and finally for Gordon's whistle. Great! Let's continue and take the red color. Red. It's for Gordon's lower part. Then stripes on his engine. Areas above the wheels. The wagon. And the door. Excellent! Now, I am taking the blue color. Blue. It's for the most part of the wagon and Gordon himself. His almost full body is painted in bright shiny blue color, and even the driving wheels. Go on coloring. Don't stop! Right! There you go! Good job! Here I will take the grey color. Grey! Obviously, I will use this color for Gordon's face and just a little bit for the wagon's wheels. And again, I will use a tiny bit of a blue color for the wagon here. Here we go, just around the digit 4, right? Our next color here will be black. Black. I will apply it for Gordon's roof, pile of coal in the wagon, for the pipe, area right behind and under Gordon's face. And also, 
Some of it for the big and small wheels. And my next step to add some more black color as a shade on the train. Just like this. After the shade, I will use some dark blue color. First, for one of the driving wheels, then for the area around the window, for the engine, just a bit for the wagon, and again some more blue for the wheels. Yeah, like that. Fantastic! Now Gordon looks so real and alive. This is just awesome. Stay with us and learn how to draw all your favorite trains. Good luck to you kids. Amazing job.